background, awesome individual. Let me give you a little bit about his background. He started off in banking, helping those individuals in this community achieve their financial goals of being good stewards of their finances, uh, becoming homeowners, and just overall making appropriate financial goals in the, in the community. Then from there, those same people, he went to insurance, putting policies in place so individuals can you know, rest at night knowing that if anything was occurred, things were in order to continue to take care of their families. Once he accomplished those goals, he went on and got even deeper in the community and got into law enforcement. He became a law enforcement um, officer. At the same time, continue his, continue his connection to the community, volunteering in schools, mentoring youth at risk, and just you know, setting an awesome example. Has moved up to become a major within the Fort Lauderdale Police Department and continues to this day to keep his ties to the community, helping all individuals and, prote and protecting the uniform on the communities. So without further ado, I want to introduce to you Dr. Gregory Salters. How's everybody doing? Wait, I can't hear you. How you doing? Now, you all heard Dr. Jones talk about me, but when you around people, you know how they say if you, your grandmother probably told you, watch the company you keep? See, I keep good company with Dr. Jones because this is a guy that has been working out here in the community. And you know, when I met him, he was played football. You know, he looks like he played football, but you know the funny thing about him? This is what I like about people. You see him, he played football, but he went on to get his doctorate because we understand the importance of education. And I want to thank him. I want to thank Ms. Smith for having me out here and Ms. McKestry. When you talk about 30 years dealing with giving back to the community and dealing with the arts, and this young lady on the violin, I, I, I played the violin a long time ago, but um, I, I would go get it, but thank you. <laughs> outstanding job. So for those of us that ever wondered the importance of arts and education, it's oftentimes the arts and education that deals with the peace because that is how we express ourselves. So when you're expressing that song and you're playing on that, it's a difference between playing music and interpreting music because sometimes people just play it and they don't really have the feeling. And when we're talking about peace and you're talking about peace here, one thing about peace is it transcends. That means it goes in front of and beyond just our color, who we believe in, where we grew up. It goes all over the world. And the interesting thing about peace is where do you all think peace begins? With us. Is that what we say? It all begins with us. And I like to talk about success. And where does success begin? With us. So a lot of times it doesn't matter what other people are doing, but what are you doing? And in school, we're talking about bullying. Who can stop bullying? We can, because one, we start by not bullying. And then if we know someone that is being bullied, it starts with us to speak to someone else. And as adults, when we're talking to our kids and when we're talking about things that are going out there, can you all imagine what our world would be like if we focus more on our similarities other than our differences? Because many times we get confused focusing on differences. Let me just see by a show of hands, how many people want to be successful? Okay, so that, that should be just about everybody. So now can you all imagine if we focused on that where we could go and how peaceful we would be because everybody is fighting to be successful. I like doing that because one thing about success and peace if we help other people get success and we help other people seek peace, it doesn't take anything from us. So when you're going out there and you're representing Ramblewood Middle School, no matter where you go from now on, you're part of the peace that started here at Ramblewood. You all are going out into the community, you're going out into the world, but it all begins with you and what you're taking out there. So let, in this holiday season, let us remember that let it begin with us. Peace begins with us, and let's take it out into the community and to the world. I thank you all for allowing me to speak to you. I am Dr. Gregory A. Salters. Thank you.